Madera Canyon is a bird lover's paradise. Nestled in the Santa Rita Mountains, Madera Canyon's various altitudes provide contrasting microclimates that support over 250 bird species, some of which are rarely seen elsewhere in the United States. Visitors travel from all over the world to see the abundant collection of colorful birds here. One of these treasures is the elegant trogon, the most sought-after bird in the park. This resplendent bird normally lives in Mexico and Central America, but can be seen at a small number of canyons in the mountainous region of southern Arizona. Madera Canyon is one of these, thanks to the Arizona sycamore trees that elegant trogons prefer. Elegant trogons rely on woodpeckers as they nest in tree cavities drilled out by the woodpeckers. Thankfully, there are a plentiful supply of woodpeckers here at Madera Canyon. The most common percussionist of this park is the acorn woodpecker. They're easy to find at the Madera Canyon picnic area and Santa Rita lodge feeders as they are quite loud and vocal birds. Acorn woodpeckers are more social than other woodpeckers and can often be found in large groups. At the feeders, you'll also find the Arizona woodpecker and ladderback woodpecker. These can be found elsewhere in the forest as they are more adaptable, but the Arizona woodpecker is mostly a Mexican species that barely reaches into southern Arizona and New Mexico, so bird watchers are on the lookout for this species. Ladder-backed woodpeckers look similar to downy or hairy woodpeckers, but their distinct ladder-shaped plumage reveals the difference. The Gila woodpecker occasionally drops in to feed on dead trees, but sticks to drier habitats outside the canyon. Gilded flickers also occasionally chime in. The regal red-naped sapsucker stands out as it drums holes into the tree. After it creates a circle of intrusions around the limb, the sap will be enjoyed by not only the sap sucker, but insects, hummingbirds, and any other observant birds nearby. After the sap sucker had its fill, I was lucky to watch a ruby-crowned kinglet enjoy the sap along with a painted red start. Painted red starts add a splash of color as they sing around the oak woodlands of Madera Canyon. The elevation of this sky island is what attracts these colorful warblers that are normally found in Mexico. Painted red starts are actually more related to white starts. When hunting, they fan out their white wings which flushes the insects, making them easier to find. Young painted red starts have been observed fanning their tail feathers before they were even fully grown. Among the colorful birds of Madera Canyon are its 15 species of hummingbirds. Gorgeous displays of iridescent feathers can be seen at the Santa Rita Lodge feeders. The large Rivoli's hummingbird boasts purple and seafoam colors as it confidently sings amongst its peers. Rivoli's hummingbird used to be considered the magnificent hummingbird, an appropriate name until its two subspecies became distinct enough to officially be considered their own species. Its range barely enters the southwestern U.S., making Madera Canyon one of the few places that you can find Rivoli's hummingbird in the United States. Visitors frequent the Santa Rita Lodge to watch the hummingbirds at the feeders, where you can find Rufus hummingbirds, Anna's hummingbirds, black-chinned hummingbirds, calliope hummingbirds, and many more. Another charming resident is the bridled titmouse. This acrobatic singer usually hangs upside down in branches while it forages for insects and seeds. It feeds by holding seeds in between its feet as it cracks them open with its bill. Like other members of its family, bridled titmice are highly social and live in mixed flocks with chickadees, warblers, nuthatches, vireos, and many more. They help raise the young of other titmice in the flock. Bridal titmice also play the role of alarm calls in their flocks by calling out to warn others of nearby predators. It may sound like a chickadee, but its distinct black and white crest dignifies it from the other titmice in its family. Bridal titmice are popular residents at Madera Canyon, as they can be seen in all four seasons, but are difficult to find elsewhere in the United States. With desert fauna surrounding the varying altitudes of Madera Canyon, the edge of two ecosystems collides. Species that are normally only found in the desert can be found in the lower trails of the park. 
One of these birds is the Paraloxia, also known as the Desert Cardinal. It lives in mixed flocks with other northern cardinals, creating hybrid offspring that look highly similar to female northern cardinals. However, hybrid cardinals tend to have larger beaks and crests than their female northern cardinal counterparts, and more red coloration overall. The name Paraloxia combines Latin words for flame-colored and oblique beak. Their curved beaks can help you distinguish them from northern cardinals, which tend to have more triangular beaks. The Black Cardinal, a distinguished desert icon, also calls these lower elevations home. Its real name is the Phaenopepla, which is Greek for shining robe. Despite its nickname and cardinal-like appearance, it is actually not a cardinal and is related to silky flycatchers. Speaking of flycatchers, another highly sought-after bird can be found around Madera Canyon. The vermilion flycatcher is famous amongst birders and is highly desired by those traveling to Arizona. Its vibrant plumage distinguishes it from the other flycatchers, although the incomplete coloration of the juveniles is also interesting to observe. Four species of towhees can also be found in these lower elevations. Canyon towhees quietly forage on the ground with a camouflage vest. Spotted towhees are a little less quiet, as they persistently call out. Abert towhees are shy but green-tailed towhees are a little more confident as they boast their gorgeous colors. The iconic song of the black-throated sparrow can be heard in the lower elevations around Madera Canyon. It is a common bird of the deserty southwest and is joined with the rufous-winged sparrow, a testament to conservation. You may also find the orange-crowned warbler, a bird with an unfortunate name. Adorable verdans can frequently be heard singing their repetitive song at the White House picnic area. Mexican jays are common residents of the park and can be observed in large flocks here. You may also find an occasional woodhouse scrub jay mixed in the group. However, it's the fauna at the higher elevations in the park that attracts visitors like the yellow-eyed junco, the only other junco species in the U.S. Sounds of the white-breasted nuthatch can be heard at the Santa Rita Lodge, along with the gorgeous hepatic tanager. Female and juvenile hepatic tanagers have yellow feathers, whereas mature males stand out with red plumage. Kawadi Mundis are members of the raccoon family and can be found climbing the trees here. If you're lucky, you may even come across a badger on the trails. Turkeys are another resident here at Madera Canyon. You can see them at Santa Rita Lodge, but also at any of the trails throughout the park. The turkeys here are tame as they don't have to worry about hunting. This subspecies is known as Gold's Turkey and is only native to Mexico, southern New Mexico, and southern Arizona. In the late 1800s and early 1900s, Gold's Turkeys were hunted to extinction in the United States. The only turkeys that survived were the ones living in Mexico, which would later be used by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service to re-establish a living population in the United States. Thanks to these conservation efforts and new regulations, there are so many turkeys living in Madera Canyon now that it has become one of the most reliable places to observe wild turkeys in Arizona. As the sun sets, birds seek shelter in the trees as vibrant hues fill the desert forest. The peace and stillness of this hour leaves a soothing effect on the soul. Nightlife is active here, as this park is a haven for 16 species of bats and several owl species. If you're a bird lover or nature enthusiast, Madera Canyon is a must-see destination for you. The endemic bird species and fauna provide a completely unique experience that you'll never forget. With Saguaro National Park nearby, you can add dozens of bird species to your life lists in less than one week. Visit this sky island and see what it has in store for you.